M0FXB, welcome to my channel. Just a quick unboxing here with the Uniden 3600XLT scanner, which is DMR and NXDN activated. Uh, I've got my friend as well here, M6LSJ from Cheddar. Now, as you can see here, we've got the Uniden SDS 100 color scanner as well. These are a similar size, but the color one is quite chunky. It's got a much bigger battery. It does not have AA batteries. Uh, so, you know, the, there's a massive difference on the price. You're talking 400 to 450 for the black and white version here, which is still an excellent device and pretty much does the same thing. Um, and then you've got, you know, seven at 700 pound for this one. And you pick these up secondhand in the, you know, 300 ish, 500 ish. So let's just take it out of the box um, uh, and show you what you get for your. These things are selling in the UK with Radio World, Moonraker, companies like that. For, I think they're about 440. So let's just slide it out and show you what you get in the box. Yeah, coming out good, and always look after the boxes, because uh, when you come to sell it, that will help you with the resale value if you've still got your box, so um, highly recommend you keep that. So let's turn this round and see what you get included in this box. You get the instruction manual here, paper instruction manual. With scanners, they, they, they don't operate in the same way as a ham radio does. So there's quite a bit of learning through, but the good news is that you can manually dial a frequency and also just select the, the numbers on the, on the keypad here. You can select them and it will search entire bands. So that, that's a quick way of using a scanner and you can also type in frequencies and save them as well. So that's your, your programming cable there. And the style it uses is that style. And that will interface you with the software on your PC laptop or uh, and it's very good for charge for charging the device as well. And these do come with, I, I believe it's three AA batteries included. So you've got your adapters there for the UK, for your main supply. That's your, um, your charger uh, for your cigarette lighter adapter there. And then here we've got the belt clip, quite a chunky belt clip on these. That's your belt clip there. I don't tend to use them, but it's a good quality one. Then the actual device, and um, there's your, take that out. That's your, it's almost like a phone charger, USB phone charger, uh, which you just plug your USB into here, and then just charge it up by connecting it in the side of the radio. You also get, Your, your carry strap there and your antenna is let's grab the antenna here quite making a lot of make a lot of mess here right there's your antenna and with these these unit models they do come with the SMA connector there and then they give you an adapter um, which we'll find in a minute so, um, let's just open this up, like so. So there's the device. Screw this on here, like so, and then let's see if there's any charge in it. We'll move this box out of the way. Um, hold it down. Where's the power here? It's a, like I said, it's a black and white screen. You can turn on the, the screen by pressing this button here, the power button. And then you've got on this system, if you push down, you've got the volume, let's turn it down. And then you've got system, department and channels there along the bottom, which is the same as the screen at the top. You've got system, department channels. You can scroll through your system by pressing the hold button. So you press system like that and you can scroll through it. You may have to press it twice. Scroll through your systems and then your subsystems would be your departments and then your individual frequencies here as well. So that's it, just an unboxing for now. Lots of videos on this already and a good audio on these. Nice, nice, nice clear speaker on these. You've got on the right hand side here, you've got your GPS antenna, your USB there and charging and then there's your, your three batteries and underneath the batteries you'll find there's your, so I can get one out show you the SD card, quite fiddly getting these out, <laughs> there you are, SD cards in there look, 
and there's a switch in there that you need to switch if you're going to use rechargeable batteries belt clip goes on there and function here at the top and menu let's just quickly show you that turn it on and you can have a color, a color screen with this with software you've got pro scan and bootel so there's your main menu there scroll down through and you, in in the uk we're mainly using what they call favorites okay favorites are groups of channels you can see all them there in america they they have the button here that's called list is 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 a postcode search or a zip code search and they can add in whole departments we can still do that with this set but we need to be using uh, the software or importing items into the SD card, which is detected as soon as you plug in to the USB. The other thing that happens with the, if you plug into the USB, if I put this one in here, like so, it will give you the option to, to go into USB mass storage or a net or a serial port for your PC. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye for now. 7.3, all the best.